place. I'll kind of help you out with that if, if you, like I tell you which one to shoot. Um, after, you, after you do that, then you're going to move to the other side here, and you're going to shoot things down. Now, those things are supposed to fall, so this would be pretty simple. You shoot until they knock down. All right, so you need a little bit of help setting these, but it's pretty black and white. Except for some of you guys at the 22. I'm not exactly sure how you're going to knock them down, but we'll see. It's part of, part of the challenge. Um, so you're going to have to do a reload here at some point, okay? Honestly, I don't care how you do it. Actually, it would depend on what game you play as to what reload you have to do. If you shoot like 3-gun or USPSA, there's no rules on reload. So in that, if that was the case, wherever you ended up with here, you would actually reload while you're moving over to here. You could just like drop your mag and throw another mag in. Okay, that's faster because you're doing two things at the same time. You're actually covering that distance and moving and reloading. So, uh, as opposed to what they call like a standing reload. So let's say I just I shoot and I end up with whatever uh, two x. I got two shots left in the gun and I hit hit all these six and then I run over to here and I shoot two more and I'm empty and now I got a reload. So now you're you're basically eating all that time of the reload. That whole whatever, two, three, four seconds it takes you to reload, that's all counting against you. Whereas if you do here, <coughs> if it takes you two sec or three seconds to move over here and two seconds to reload, you're combining them. You're doing them at the same time. You're saving time. Now, in some disciplines, it's all about the rules. In some disciplines, you're not allowed to do that. Uh, you would actually have to shoot empty, and you have to be empty and reload. So I honestly do not care how you pick whichever one you want to do here. If you want to just shoot empty over to here, that's fine. Um, it's going to be a little slower. Just kind of a real quick thing on the reload. I'm not going to do my normal long detailed spiel because we're just not going to have the time for it. But uh, when you reload the gun, the most important thing to do when you're reloading the gun or anytime you're clearing a malfunction or doing anything with the gun, okay, is to do it right here in your your workspace okay which is again is not a natural thing so many people they want to do this all the way out here or down here I, I see hundreds of people and that's the natural reaction people are naturally scared of the gun because it goes boom fire comes out of it and so the idea of doing anything with the gun right here is just not a natural thing you're like oh something like that just think if you were trying to thread a needle or a fish hook or work on a swiss watch or do something very fine you would not do it out here or you do it like right here because it's easier it's the same thing with this um, so bringing that gun right back into here when you reload is very important I, I bring it back in and I'm holding it to where the mag was it's kind of pointed at the at the magazine here I'm not not pointed at the ground when I grab the magazine you really got to try to get very high on the magazine if, if you if you can okay this is not good this is worse. This is what you want to, want to have your finger literally by the bullet. So I have a lot of control. If I bump this, if, if, if you, you can't really knock it out of my hand like this. But if it's like this, it, it, it falls out really easy. Um, so that's, that's, that's a lot of it, right? You know, just right in there like that. Comes out. I'm doing it right here. If I miss it, I can fix it. For those of you guys that shoot the gun empty and got a reload, if you can do it, uh, obviously when I put the magazine in, I gotta, I gotta release the slide somehow. The fastest way if you can do it is to hit the release with your strong hand thumb. That's a little faster than going over top. If you're not very well trained, uh, it is a little more of a gross motor skill movement doing that, but this is a faster way. It, it, it's, the, it's no more of a fine motor skill than pulling the trigger, so if you're well trained, you can do that. The second fastest way would be just simply hitting the magazine release with the the strong hand thumb or with the support hand thumb. Either way, that is a critical skill that very few people practice. And the practical shooter, you need to be able to reload the gun quickly. I, I know some of you guys are with 22, so it's going to be slow, but I, I'm just going to do you know this because we want to put some things together here. Okay? So, and it's just a little more, this is not hard, but it is more complicated than anything else we've done. So because of that, the getting kind of jacked up and, and making mistakes tends to happen more. So just, just, just take it easy on this. 
So, yeah. Do you expect us to drop the mag on the ground or keep it? In That's I'm going to leave it up to you. Uh, I'm going to drop it on the ground to tell you that. I'm just, I'm just going to do a, a normal speed reload on this. Uh, it, it, it's, it's totally up to you. There's a lot of different theories on that. Uh, most of the time in real life scenarios, you're probably going to shoot the gun empty. Uh, normally that's what you're, you're going to do, you shoot the gun empty and, and reload. But I can think of scenario, you can dream up a circumstance for anything. I can think of circumstances when you do a speed reload in a gun. And you've got three or four mags and you need to, I mean I can see a circumstance where it could happen. So anyways, alright. Everybody understand? I'll do this first. You guys get a little bit of exercise and reset in the place, but we'll, we'll get everybody through this. So we're going to draw. I'm going to hopefully be able to tell if I hit these plates. We'll see. Obviously, just go to the Reload. Over to there. Those are hard to tell if I hit. Yeah. We will reach that guy's